Dear Riddles of Heroes Cam, I'm now behind a third vogue who's taken part in the final of MGP with the song You Like a Melody. Welcome. Uh, how does it feel to be here? It feels great today. Uh, we've been through all these rehearsals and now I feel secure. I'm looking forward to singing in Spectrum for so many beautiful Norwegians and, and foreigners coming to see the show. So we know you from before as a composer. You took part in uh, Melody Grand Prix whole times uh, 2009 and 2010. And you uh, took part in Eurovision last year two times for Georgia and Norway. So you represented your own country and then got into the top 10 with Georgia. Uh, what are your uh, reflections about uh, Eurovision last year? Um, it was a great experience. It was beyond my imagination to, to get to Eurovision with two songs the same year. And that was just amazing. I, I sat, of course, with Diedrich because I am Norwegian, but um, I saw Georgia getting lots of points and I was like, yay, that's my song too. <laughs> so it was a lot of fun. And now you're taking part as a singer. Why decide to take the step? Uh, well, actually, uh, I started as a singer and I released uh, two albums. So um, you can say that my heart belongs to the performing part of the music industry from the beginning. But then um, my songs got so so much interest from, from publishers, record labels and artists. And uh, it was a great opportunity for me to write for other artists. So actually... Um, what I really love to do is to sing, so it was the natural step to go back to that. And what are the differences between taking part as a composer and as a singer in such a competition? Well, really mostly it's the partying, because when you're a composer you can just go around and toast in champagne and stay out late nights. And, and now I have to focus on my vocal performance and therefore you have to get enough sleep, you can't drink too much, you know. All of those things, but it's, it's good for the health, I guess, to be a singer. <laughs> Not that much partying. <laughs> and uh, as I said, the song is uh, You Like a Melody. What is it about? It's about being in love um, in the very beginning. So uh, it's when you get someone uh, sort of stuck in your head and you can't uh, stop thinking about them. Kind of like uh, the, the melody that you just keep on humming and you can't get it out of your head. So you took part in the second semi-final in Florida? Yep. And you got through to the final. Did you expect to go through? I was hoping. <laughs> and I had so much experience of being a composer, so I really felt that my, my song was strong enough to, to go through to the final. Uh, but you never know. It's uh, the, up to the people. And there were so many great... Uh, contributions and uh, so I, I couldn't be sure of course but uh, I hoped and luckily I made it to the final because this is amazing. And so now that you're in the final, do you, did you make any changes to your outfit, to your performance? Uh, well, I think the dress worked as a charm. It got me a lot of attention and the color was great in the on the TV screen. So I'm keeping the dress. Uh, I've changed uh, my shoes. <laughs> I've got new uh, Lobota shoes <laughs> <laughs> and some new earrings and, um, well, I, I guess just mentally even, even more... Um, eagerness to, to do the song and, and just even more um, yeah, uh, power and, uh, and happiness. <laughs> and uh, what are your expectations for tonight? Well, this time too, I, I'm hoping for a good result, but uh, I, I can't, I don't know. And now we're in the final and everyone has competed against lots of great um, songs and artists, so this is the what the people wanted to see in the final and therefore the, the competition is tough now. So I have to be humble as well as I have to aim to win. Now that you, we, we've seen you as a singer taking part, uh, if you take part in next time, will it be as a singer or as a composer? Well, it depends on the song because this time uh, when I wrote the song I felt like, oh this is a song for me. And very often when I write songs, I feel like this is a great song, but it would be perfect for this artist or this band. Or So it depends on if I write a song that I feel I can do best myself, or if someone else can do it. A little bit depending on the genre and everything. But for now, I'm, I think I'm happy 
for at least a couple of years, I, I feel like I've accomplished and fulfilled many of my artist dreams. And finally, do you have a message for our readers from Muse Can? I just uh, hope that you love the song as much as I do, and I hope that you feel like you're in love when I sing it. Thanks so much, Hanna, and good luck for tonight.